Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. So today I'm here to test the MiFine Pro Ghost Blade. This is a tubular rod. Looks similar to the Illusion Slash, but this one is tubular, the Illusion Slash it's solid. You can already see I have 0.6 chub over there and the rod is not bending yet. So let's try to catch the last couple of fish that are on this creek. The creek is very very low. In here we only have chub. Uh, how do I, I catch this like this? I have it paired with a 800 size reel. Zero point six shab weight on the end of it with a small small plastic. Let's see if I can catch something for the camera. The only thing I caught on camera was a creep following me while I was going down the creek. Uh, usually I don't mind talking to people but this one was very creepy oh almost fell on the water but no problem i recoup myself and continue to go downstream so as soon as i pass the bridge i know there's a deeper spot under the metal pipe and i just cast over there i know it looks like a wide creek but it's not that wide and i have to be very careful with my cast so i don't have everything tangled but very pinpoint casting and the first one first one in the bag as usual going downstream Ah, it's Kristen the ghost plate. Continuing on my way down the creek to the main river and... I think the guys over here have a lack of commitment. Really lack of commitment because a lot of nibbling, a lot of taking the tail out of my supercontinent soft plastic but no hook sets on this damn fish. I will just do a couple of casts with this heavier of weight. It's too heavy for the depth that we have in here, even though it's just 0 0.6. <coughs> and give it a couple more casts just on the open river to test the capabilities of the rod on the max of the cast weight. And then look how shallow is over here this is the end of the creek so the last small levee that we have and throwing my lure on the deeper spots of the creek so right over there where you see the darker uh, stones on the bottom there's like maybe half a meter depth let's see what works in here oh bite but no success so i went on the main river for some longer casts jesus so many attacks and none of them gets a full hook set there is a huge one over there and for sure he's not interested in what I have to offer. I'm not sure I'm interested in that. No, I am sure. I am not interested in that. Why? Ooh, no, no. Second one of the day, cannot complain. This is why I got this rod, so I can fish whenever, whatever I want. So, very, very small guy. This is not a chub, it's a shkalo. I will put the scientific name on the card. Ah, 
still, let's try to get an upgrade on this around the reefs over there. Jesus, more nibbling. And another one. Oh, it's an upgrade. A pretty shove. It's hard to catch these guys on the open river. They are smarter in here. So if you want to see the capabilities on the casting of this rod, just see me throwing this 0.6 jab on the tree ah, on the other side of the river. Right on the tree. Recover it. Nice save. Oh. Ah, a sunfish just came after it. Right, since where it fell on the on the floor, on the floor, on the bottom. Jeez. This is a sunfish. A lot of nibbling. And they are the only ones fast enough to nibble on the while I'm retrieving. So that's the side for the sunfish. Yep, another one on the pink stuff. Again, not a shove, I think, it's a shkalo. So, running low on battery, see you guys in a bit, see if I catch anything else. So, I'm finishing what I started today. I had too much fun for the crappy weather that I have today, it's a cold front. Fishing should suck, it didn't suck, I caught a lot of ding fish, but better to catch ding, ding fish than nothing. Ghost plate if you don't like the illusion because it's too slow this may be the rod for you i cast everything on the cast weight of this rod from 0.6 grams to 0.2 grams what i'm using right now and i've used had such a fun time for the weather that i have and for the water water that i have the water levels are very very low fishing is very very slow but still i managed to catch more than half a dozen fish in like two hours so i'm pleased i really like the um, ghost plate it's different than the illusion it's more suited if you are already a lure fisherman a guy that likes to cast soft plastics um, Again, if you are an European that was used to catch fish with maggots on slower rods, maybe the illusion is bad for you. It's uh, easier to set the hooks on the illusion. But also on this one, it's different to convey you. But this one, you have good feeling. It's faster. Um, you can react fast if you need. So uh, this one will be better for hard mounted fish. Like if you are going after sunfish, or bass for chub 
maybe the illusion is a bit better because it's a bit slower but I'm really running low on juice I will see you guys 